you. I'm not touching his butt. You go touch his butt. I think the whole thing is butt. I have to... What is up, Rumble Pack? Rumble here, bringing you a video requested by a longtime friend, little brother. Actually, I call him my son. Let's be honest. He's like my he's like my son, Gumby, asking about Restream IO. I know a lot of you have been having like issues with Restream IO. I've honestly only set it up once. One time, and I I guess I just got lucky. That's just how I roll. But yeah, I've had a few people having issues with it, so I figured I'd do a quick video on how to set it up, or at least you could follow along, because I'm just gonna basically go and set it up. You know, just just go through the motions of setting it up, show you what I can, what I cannot. So if you're a, a multi-streamer, you, you like to broadcast to different platforms. So you got your YouTube, you got your Twitch, you got your Hitbox, you got your Beam. If you got all those and you want to get them all set up so that you can broadcast to one place and then it goes to all of them, Restream.io is a good option. It's free. They do a lot of development on it. They're constantly updating their stuff. A few of you have had issues. I don't know where those issues could stem from it's usually pretty straightforward but we'll do something show you how it's done so uh yeah let's get to it all right everybody so what we got here is this is what you're going to see when you go to restream.io you go to that web website there and you're going to get this screen so what you want to do is if you've never signed up before you hit the sign up it goes through the motions it's pretty straightforward you put in your your uh, email address and a password that you can use so you hit the sign up button it gets you all signed up but in my case i'm just going to log in so i'm logged in now usually you get blanks here for the sake of this video we're going to do this dun, dun. the delete we're deleting this channel so I got rid of that. We're going to add a channel. Look at all the options you've got here. There's tons of streaming sites you can go to. Most popular for us gamers are Beam, Twitch, and YouTube Gaming. Hitbox has always been there, but we're going to set up. We're going to set up Twitch here. So you click your Twitch. You want to be logged in to your account on Twitch. You're going to hit up your dashboard. So you go back to your Restream IO, and you connect Twitch. Usually, go straight to this. You're all set to go in the event that this does not work i've authorized it it shows up on my list but in the event that that does not work you can set it up manually you're gonna hit add channel you're gonna hit twitch set up manually pretty straightforward audit auto detect your server usually a good option if you use xsplit or obs you can test which server works best but restream io is pretty good they'll grab a good server for you you can use that option you need your key so i'm not going to show you my key but you need to go here you show your key you copy your key plop it in there and then you get your channel url which in my case is twitch.tv slash rumble with the two m's so you just you can copy you can paste that you're all set you, you got that going so next thing you need to do is set up whatever software you can use obs xsplit and i'll show you how that's all done with xsplit if you know how to set up your obs it's going to have similar ideas so then you got your outputs set up a new output you're going to go to custom rtmp name pretty straightforward whatever you want to name it so you want to know that it's the restream output that you're using so typically i would say just put restream or something along those lines so you know that's what you're outputting to description that's up to you that's uh pretty much what it's going to put out uh as a description for everyone to see when you're streaming but typically people don't go to your restream page to watch your streams they're going to go to twitch they're going to go to beam they're going to go to hitbox wherever you're, you you have your um your account set up so you don't really need to set up a description here rtmp url you need to go to this little bad boy right here your url is based off of this now i don't know why i'm going east washington's probably not the closest option but it auto detects these things out of the gate for you so you might want to pick something that's reasonably close to you so you copy that right here that's all set next you need a stream name stream names pretty straightforward 
Uh, it's not called stream name, it's a stream key. You take your stream key, you just click in there, it reveals it, it pretty much copies it, like highlights it for you. You go back to this, your stream name, you put that in there and you're pretty much set. So you don't need to worry about share link, not important. All your settings you're gonna have to do when you get a chance, uh, figure out what your upload is and what the appropriate number for you. Uh, Twitch, Beam, Hitbox, all of those, like can do, I think the, the proper amount is about 2,600. So if you have an upload that can support that, put 2,600, often they will recommend 2,100 depending on your connection. But yeah, I say go about 2,600 if you can do it. You hit okay, that saves your settings and you're pretty much all set and ready for Restream. You're just gonna click that and away you go. That is how you set up Restream IO for your streaming needs across all networks. But thanks to Gumby for asking me to do this. i uh, been looking for motivations to do little videos. So if you got any other ideas, leave a comment down below. Subscribe to the channel. Let me know what you think in the comments below about everything that I do here. Give that thumbs up. I appreciate you guys coming back. But welcome to the Rumble Pack, everybody. We hope to do more videos here. I'm Rumble, and we will see you again very soon. Have a great freaking day.